Hello, today I'm joined by my good friend, Mr. Ben Sellers from Starbury. Ben, how are you, sir? I am very well, thanks, David. All the better for being in front of you. Well, talking about being in front of me, you'll be within touching distance uh, next week because we'll be meeting at the EA Masters. It's it's a really sort of eclectic mix of, of agents and suppliers that you tend to get at the EA Masters. And there's an interesting mix of almost education, inspiration and celebration all in the, under the same roof. So what is it that you love about it? Uh, I, it's exactly what you said there. It's, you know, we're we're all desperate to go human, aren't we? I'm dying to give you a big hug and <laughs> anyone else that I know. Um, and Russ and myself will obviously, Russ is a big hugger, my brother. Um, and then we've got our colleague, Steve Ryan, who's going to be uh, helping us, you know, cope with all the uh, demand that comes to our Starbury stand. Uh, but no, the reality is I, it, it's a great day for meeting people. Uh, meeting our fellow suppliers who so many of us have, have built some great relationships with, we're integrating with, um, and also to see what Peter Knight's got up his sleeve because he always blows me away and the whole EA, EA Masters feels, it is the sort of the, the event of the year and, it, uh, and you always learn stuff, you know, there's always some great speakers. I purposely almost stayed away from it so I can just, you know, be surprised by it all. But yeah, just can't wait for that sort of hype um, and and turning up on the day to see what, what comes from it. And I think it's probably fair to say because all the people in the room on the day are, are they're, they're winners. And I don't just mean that in terms of, you know, they're, they're very good at what they do, but they are genuine sort of, they're there to collect awards, et cetera. Um, people are in a good mood and it's and it's, there's a lovely sort of buzz about it. Um, so we're looking forward to seeing everybody next week. Now, if you wander down to the Starbury stand and you meet Russ and Ben and Steve, they're, they're lovely, lovely people. Um, but I encourage you to, to really sort of take some time um, to understand the magic that they weave so well. Um, they, they're not just providing websites. They are a lead generation leviathan and uh you need to sort of take to take advantage of that but you've also got a couple of of new launches that are going on I'm gonna stay tight-lipped about that but they're coming out on the big day aren't they that's right yeah we've got a, we've got some uh great new uh product line i guess one could say within the web uh space um this is aimed to hopefully uh, put Starbury in a position where we can work with a much broader client base. We might have traditionally been more focused on the middle to high end market, which we obviously continue to do. Um, but really, we've seen through our digital marketing team um, how there's just so many opportunities uh, to, to create um, great outcomes if we can control the space. Uh, i.e. Their, their, their platform. So we've tried to come up with something that's going to be hopefully very exciting for those who might not want to go to a full enterprise level. Yeah. Uh, so that's that's on the website front. We're on the enterprise level or for those who are keen to develop like applications or something that's really an idea in the tech, uh, prop techie kind of space. Um, but they need they don't know where to start where do i get a development team you know people who a project manager who can run this or product owner and so on um we have built a dedicated resource model now um so that you can get a really affordable resource that is working full or part time for you week in week out releasing products um uh that you know might be sort of digital transformation, you know, for example, uh, it might be some pre-val custom valuation tool that you have behind the scenes or, or something like that. And so we found a, a lot of excitement around that and something that we're, we're looking forward to sharing on the day in more detail. Fascinating stuff. And you've, uh, you, you are wearing right now one of your very famous um, Starbury caps. And I know that this isn't necessarily a smash and grab for merch this year, but 
you did tell me that for super fans and for people that are taking the time to build uh, relationships with you, um, there are a select few knocking about. So that's all I'm going to say. I'm not promising anybody anything, all right? But I'm just saying, no, I... it's not your average trucker cap. This is high quality, high end merch, and it, your kids would wear it quite happily because it's cool enough, right? Well, that's the aim. It's limited edition, you know, inspired by Supreme. You know, we, we've always wanted to make something that is quality, and that's really Starberry's ethos. And so the hats, you know, though we had a very a good time in the lockdown and we did that massive hat campaign with a, with a particular range, the sort of fruity flavoured ones with different coloured backs, we've upped our game and we've got sort of more... 3D sort of puff embroidery um, and there's been a hell of an appetite so it's a very limited edition you've got to be a part of the Starberry uh, you know constellation should I say <laughs> and and in one way or the other and then you'll get your hands on one constellations are great a great term for it because they're all stars aren't they it's, it's, that's right that's it's all our, our customers and the the team and suppliers that we work with it's all part of the constellation awesome I, that's a word that that ben uses a lot it's awesomeness but there's plenty of it going on at starbury and if you manage if you're lucky enough to grab him for five minutes of conversation this guy is, a, is an idea, is an inspiration, Bella, and it will open your mind to different possibilities because a lot of us are used to seeing the same old, same old, and we don't often think outside of that box. But all the conversations I've had with Ben have all pushed me in that direction, and it's good to be challenged creatively like that. So uh, grab hold uh, of it. Thanks, David. You're making me blush. Oh, well, there you go. He's gone purple, everybody. I've finally done it. <laughs> <laughs> ben, looking forward to seeing you in real life next week at the EA Masters. Thank you for your time. I can't wait, man. There'll be a big hug waiting for you. I, I, I'm going to hold you to that. See you soon. All right. Yeah, take care, man. Bye-bye. <laughs>